Even the free junk is junk. I don't know who you are, but you are a riot. Uh, no, I excel at functions such as these. Didn't you see how impressed everyone was when I faked my death? I even love the horrid liquids they serve. <laughs> yeah, they always give us the off-brand junk. Let me try something. Don't worry, I didn't spit in it. Whoa! Hey, that's actually good. How'd you change the flavor? Little trick I taught myself. Changing the chemistry of a liquid with sound waves. See? Hard magic can be cool. People just don't give it a shot. <laughs> all right, I get it. If you whistle loud enough, can you make all this less of a drag? I wish. This is my third time. Always the same boring activities, same boring faces. <laughs> Till whittle all me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <gasps> How'd you get those? Oh, these are from last year. Maybe if you stick with me, I'll show you how to get one of your own. All right, I'm Ida Clothorn. Rain whispers. I wonder what I'll get a ribbon for. Strength, wit, radiance. You'll get one for being a dingus. Well, you're gonna get one for Think Fast! Why do you come here? You're not like the other kids. You're, I don't know, you're cool. Say to Epiderm isn't cheap, but if I make the school look good, I get a scholarship. What about you? I made a deal with the devil. Our principal's gonna expel me unless I come back with a ribbon. <laughs> Chance at redemption? Nah, I think I'm being used to embarrass our vice principal, as if he doesn't do that to himself already. It stinks, but I've got a sister at Hexide. She's kind of my only friend. It'd be a bummer if that got taken away. Well, you won't have to worry about that. After the closing ceremony, we're home free. <laughs> <laughs> I hope this was worth it. Actually, Ida. Well, I think we're toast. Michael. Ugh. Ugh. Trade? Huh? Rain? What are you doing here? Oh, oh no! Your scholarship. Don't worry. I wanted to transfer out of Epiderm anyway. And apparently, my parents always hated the cold on the knee. So. Okay, Ida. Give me the rundown on this place. <laughs> Oh, you'll love it. It's got all the secrets. And since Tara spoke to Principal Faust, I can get away with pretty much anything. Mm. I've never had apple blood before. This stuff is good. Rain, I know why you're really here. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh-huh. Who cares about a stupid performance? This is more fun. Whatever you say. See, you'd be a mess without me. <clears throat> All right, Rain's Rhapsody. You know, you can't run from your fears forever, which is why you've got to get the jump on them. Give them a whack right in the face. I thought you were just joking around. I am Ida, I... Whoa, what are you doing? Uh, Rain! <laughs> uh, nothing. I'm fine. <laughs> You're lying again. It's like I don't really know you. So, I've made a decision. Okay, okay, I know how this plays out. Uh, but I'll be ready this time. You hear me, bird brain? I'm joining the Bard Coven, and... No, 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 I hate this part. I think we should see other people. 
I'm sorry, Ida. It's over. <sighs> Are you okay? Is this the curse? Just tell them. Let them help. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's normal. You can leave now. I can't do this anymore. Sorry, we're not accepting new members. Is that any way to treat an old friend? Rain whispers. So, the head witch of the Bard Coven likes pretending to be a rebel. Too bad they're not very good at it. Ida! You're embarrassing me in front of my crew. Huh? huh? <sighs> hey, it's all right, everyone. The Owl Lady is an old friend. Actually, she's the one that inspired me to make the group. Huh? It was a while ago. If you've got nothing to lose, we could use the help. Ooh. Rainstorm? <laughs> Haven't heard that in a minute. Oh, you've gotten so strong, it's incredible. But how'd you become head bard with your stage fright? I'm just that good. What about you? Do you still know any bard spells? Well, you remember the curse. It messes with my magic. <gasps> how'd you become the owl lady with your stage fright? All right. You asked for this. Ha! <laughs> Rain's Rhapsody. More like Ada's Requiem, am I right? Now I'll leave the playing to the professionals. Call if you need me. <gasps> I am glad I remembered how to do that. Stop the Emperor, right? Then we play on! Ida, do you have kids? Uh, but they're not mine. Mine. Oh, it doesn't matter. They both have real families to return to. I don't know what you're running from. But a great witch once told me something about punching beers in the face. What I'm trying to say is, don't give up so easily. They probably need you more than you realize. We can find another way to stop Bellos together. Ah! Uh, Rain, don't. Go. You know I can't stand an audience. Rain, I'm so glad you're okay. Ida, what are you doing here? I had to make sure you were okay after that fight with Darius and Eber. What fight? It was just a few weeks ago. I was with you. Ida, I spent the last month sick in bed, and we... We haven't spoken in years. <gasps> Listen, I don't know what you want with me, but I'm head of a coven now, and I can't associate with wild witches anymore. So move aside. No. I'm not leaving till I get through to you. Fine. We can do this the hard way. Please! Brainstorm, stop it! I don't want to hurt you, Ida. 
But you're not giving me much of a choice. Come on, Rain. I know when you're going easy on me. I... Ugh. Did you forget this, too? Huh? Why won't you just leave me alone? Uh. <gasps> For old time's sake, I'll give you one last chance. Move. Please. So be it. I think I heard something over here. Head Witch, are you there? Surround the area! <gasps> Go home. Maybe travel for a bit. Just don't contact me again. I work for the Emperor, after all. Head Witch! <sighs> Captain, I thought I told you to. Ida? Please, just give me a minute. I'm, I'm not trying to start trouble. You're wearing a stolen uniform. And I am working it. Listen, I don't know what you're hiding, but I do know that somewhere deep inside, you still care about me. Otherwise, you wouldn't have let me walk free back at the Coven Parade. Rain, I know about the day of unity and the draining spell. Nope, I, I saw that expression. It is that bad, isn't it? And that's why I need your help. There's no time for your schemes, Ida. Wait, this is for my kids. They can't be around during the Day of Unity. To put them in a castle, bunker, get them on an airship, I don't care. Just, just keep them safe. If you do, I'll, I'll give myself up right now. I... Come along, Sprout. Places to be, hedges to trim. Awaiting further instructions, Head Witch. Stay put. I'll send someone to receive the package. Your uniform looks outdated, Captain. Looking like a pile of compost. Rain, why didn't you tell me anything? I could have helped. Is it so unbelievable that I wanted to keep you safe? But in typical Ida fashion, you're not gonna stop until you make things right. I guess not. Actually, we do. Allow me to introduce. Hey, I know that face. I've got it all under control, Rainstorm. Jealous I may be a better coven head than you? <laughs> I'll try not to impress everyone too much. Are you really willing to get a sigil? Even if your curse heals, you'll never be able to practice wild magic again. Eh, uh, my curse isn't going anywhere. I can tell it's always going to be a pain in my feathers. But if I can do this to help, why would I refuse? We're almost there! Oh, isn't it cool we get one last adventure together? Also, the curse will do its thing. I got this, Rainstorm. Don't worry. Don't. Don't tell me not to worry. Hey? I promised a special kid I'd protect you. Stay away! Uh, uh, uh. Huh? It's okay, Rain. I gotcha. I am. Still not used to this new look. But it doesn't matter. I'm just happy you're here. <gasps> Luz? You look... fluffier? How long was I out for? We don't have much time. For the collector, we got our...